Uh, Rob Rowe here with Henry Columbia, quarterback at Texas Tech, year two in Lubbock. Uh, we were just talking before we turned the camera on from Miami, spent some time in Utah. Now you're in Lubbock, Texas. Do you want to rank the three living uh, areas <laughs> of, of where you can be in yeah. the world? Uh, I think number one overall, you know, hometown, I'm going to have to go with Miami, you know, just grew up there for 18 years, so it's going to have to be number one. Number two is going to be Lubbock for sure. It's definitely more like home than uh, Logan. Logan's a pretty small town. It's, uh, it's really cold. I don't really like the cold, so it's my order, one, two, three. We need to put that on a billboard somewhere, Lubbock, closer to Miami than Logan used. Yes, that's go. for sure. Uh, national uh, name image likeness coming in, doing some endorsements, mm -hmm. uh, at least the availability to do so. Perfect endorsement for Henry Columbia, what would it be? Perfect endorsement. Um, you know, I think I've been growing my hair out for a little bit of time now, so maybe uh, some sort of hair product, you know, head and shoulder or something like that. That would be great. Patrick Mahomes, Columbia. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Uh, all right, I'm going to give you some quick hitters. Just give me uh, the first thing that comes to mind. Okay? okay. Which teammate is most likely to go viral for a dancing TikTok? Baron Martin. <laughs> Uh, what's, uh, who is your Whataburger ride or die? It's 3 a.m. You, you're trying to go to Whataburger. Who are you calling? I'm calling Jason Lloyd. Jason Lloyd. Uh, if you could add one team to the Big 12, who would you add? One team to the Big 12. Um, I saw a little rumor maybe about Boise State. You know, I, I've never beaten them. I, I'm on two versus them, so I'd like to see them come over here. Get some Bronco action yeah. here. Okay. Uh, would you want to play on the blue turf, or would you want them to come to Lubbock? Um, honestly, their stadium's pretty cool, like the way it's developed, so I'd want to go back there. All right. Uh, Madden tournament between all the Texas Tech football players. Who's taking the crown? Oh, that's an easy answer. It's me. It, you? Okay. 100%. Right. I thought you were looking over at somebody no, else. No, that's 100%. Okay. <laughs> uh, what's your secret talent? My secret talent. Um, or is it Madden? Uh, <laughs> I used to play, yeah. I used to be pretty good at a couple video games. Uh, I stopped playing as much lately, but definitely video games is one of my things. Now, would you uh, be interested in, like, streaming? Because now you can monetize uh, name image likeness there, too. Is that something that y'all, I don't know, thrown around? Or? Yeah, I mean, I, I messed around with it a little bit back in the day with, like, Fortnite and stuff like that. But I feel like it's just, like, a real big uh, commitment. So, right. I don't know. I feel pretty... uh, who on the team do you think could be a, a movie star or star in the next, like, rock movie? Uh... <laughs> The next rock movie? Yeah, like yeah, the rock needs a co-star. Who, who's gonna go in and be the buddy cop with the rock? Uh, I'd probably say Travis. Travis. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. And then maybe a little bit of a serious question. Uh, coronavirus, obviously, mm -hmm. COVID nineteen, last year and a half. Uh, how has that impacted you personally, and and maybe in football or otherwise? Uh, I think it's really crazy to like live through something like this. You know, it's affected not only on the field but off the field. My family's had it, and um, I had to, like, deal with it. I mean, I had it, too. I didn't have any symptoms. But I think it's just the way that everyone's handling. You know, everyone has their own opinion on it, which I'm not going to comment on or anything. But um, I think it, with football, it just makes it a lot tougher, you know. You never know with close contacts and stuff, like guys being out. I mean, just like we dealt with last year. So, I mean, I'm glad that we're, like, moving forward with it. But at the same time, like, we're still, like, in the area. So I just, I'm looking forward to it being behind us. All right, going into 2021, new season, new you. Any uh, big goals? Big goals? Yeah, team or personally? Um, yeah, I want to make a bowl game this year. We were short uh, last year. Um, and then last year I was um, Big 12 honorable mention. I'd like to take it a step further, maybe third team, and just hopefully see where we go from there.